How to draw shapes using paint.net First, you open the paint.net You can double click the paint.net icon in your desktop or the start button you search paint.net then you will see the paint.net here then double click and this is now the interface of the paint.net you can see here the toolbox the colors window the history and the layers window then we have here the image list here in the colors window you have to set here the primary and the secondary color for the primary you search or you click your desired color so here I want black and then the secondary is white now you can draw anything here in the drawing area using the shapes in the toolbox you click the shapes tool and then the shapes option you will see the different kinds of shapes we have here the basic shapes the polygon and stars the arrows, callouts, and symbols. Here in the basic shapes, we have here the rectangle, the rounded rectangle, ellipse, diamond, trapezoid, parallelogram, triangle, and right triangle. To draw, click a shape here. Example, rectangle. Hold the mouse and then drag it to the drawing area. This is now the rectangle. But rectangle draw shape outline. And the brush size is 2. And the style, the brush style is solid fill with solid color now I want to draw again rectangle but this time I want to draw fill shape like this one bear in mind that if you see the little dots here it is called the resizing handle and while the resizing handle is present in the shape, you can still change the color and adjust the size. If you want to change the color here, you select here in the colors window, sample this one, and then if you want the little dots will disappear or the resizing handle, just click outside. You can draw another shape again I want to draw a rounded rectangle field draw field shape then this time I want to draw field shape with outline Pick it outside this one and then the brush width is 10 e. and the brush style I want dashes okay and then fill with horizontal okay or I want to fill it with vertical but take note the resizing handle is not in the shape anymore so if you choose vertical it will not change anymore so go back to the shape or 
to the shapes tool and then select your desired shape this is the ellipse okay and then draw field shape with outline okay let's go back to draw shape outline okay and then brush with is 20 make it 20 and then the brush tile dotted okay and then fill with percent okay you can also change it to the dark downward diagonal or dashes or the dust Or this one how about the call outs or the arrows the arrows take note or brush with here is 20 and then change it to solid diamond okay that's it Now I want to draw a house using the shapes. Now I want to draw a house using these shapes, using the shapes tool. Now I want to make another file. I will pick file and then new. And then the canvas size is 800 by 600. Then pick OK. Right. And then the shapes tool again. Click in the toolbox. And then I want to use the triangle for my roof. Okay, here's the resizing handle. You can still change. Uh, I want to change this brush width size into 10. Okay, so take note we are in the solid diamond. Click outside so that the resizing handle will disappear. And for the body, go back to rectangle. For the rectangle, take note you can draw rectangle or square. Rectangle or square. can drag while the resizing handle is present in the shape then adjust the size I want to draw stairs using the trapezoid But this time, I want solid shape, the solid color, and then draw field shape. Okay, here it is. And then I want to draw the door. I will use again the rectangle. So, I am drawing now the draw field tree. If you want to draw outline while the recessing handle is still here, you can still change it and then draw shape outline. And then you change the style into solid. Here it is. Now you, you put the window or the windows use the rectangle 
I want I want the diagonal cross right then click outside then draw the other side and then the door knob I want the heart solid color big outside okay I want to have a design here I want to change the color okay you can still drag it while the resizing handle is present in the shape Click outside. And then for the gate, I want to use again the rectangle. This one. But this time, I want the large grid. This time I want solid Sol solid shape, the draw field shape. And then this one the solid one, solid color. I want to change the color. So while the resizing handle is still present in the shape, you can still change the color. side and the Ellis tool we want to change the color and then the other side. This one. Then shape size or the brush width size. I want 45 and dashes. I want dashes. Dark horizontal. I got one. Then change the color. I want to change the color in. Then outline change it to solid color. Okay, try it to solid and then. the 
size it's smaller draw the clouds by using the fallouts here you can change the color and then this one that's it that's how simple to draw a house using shapes in paint.net to save just click file then save us then you you type dream house. save it in picture library or you can save it in your folder that you created during your performance task so I have here also my folder this one ratios file okay. then click save click OK now you go to your folder where you save the file then check it if the file is, is there here's my folder ratios file and then here it is my dream house ok that's it